Welcome to the future of trucking. Today, we're diving deep into an exciting and sustainable solution for the transportation industry, hydrogen semi-trucks. The trucking sector responsible for transporting approximately 70% of freight in the United States is facing immense pressure to reduce its carbon footprint amid growing concerns about climate change and air quality. Traditional diesel trucks are a significant contributor to greenhouse gas emissions, leading to a push for cleaner alternatives, Enter Hydrogen Technology, a game changer that promises to revolutionize the way we transport goods. What are hydrogen semi-trucks? Hydrogen semi-trucks are vehicles designed to run on hydrogen as a fuel source. One of the leading models in this space is the H2ICE MAN developed by MAN Truck & Bus. Unlike traditional diesel trucks, hydrogen semi-trucks can operate using two primary technologies, hydrogen internal combustion engines, H2ICE, and hydrogen fuel cells. This flexibility allows manufacturers to leverage existing engine technologies while transitioning to cleaner fuels. So, how do hydrogen internal combustion engines work? Let's focus first on hydrogen internal combustion engines. Combustion process in an H2ICE, hydrogen gas is injected into a combustion chamber. This chamber is designed to mix hydrogen with air and ignite the mixture. When hydrogen combusts, it reacts with oxygen to produce water vapor as the main byproduct. Unlike diesel combustion, which produces carbon dioxide and other harmful emissions, hydrogen combustion is significantly cleaner. Fuel injection. The hydrogen is delivered into the combustion chamber via fuel injection systems. There are two methods, port fuel injection, where hydrogen is mixed with air before entering the combustion chamber, and direct injection, where hydrogen is injected directly into the cylinder at high pressure. This requires modifications to the traditional fuel delivery systems found in diesel engines, as hydrogen needs to be handled under high pressure. Ignition System Hydrogen can be ignited in several ways. While traditional diesel engines rely on compression ignition, where the air is compressed to a point that ignites the fuel, hydrogen can be ignited using spark plugs. This versatility allows for smoother operation and can potentially improve efficiency compared to diesel engines. Hydrogen combustion generates high temperatures, so the cooling systems must be adapted to manage this heat. Moreover, the exhaust systems need modifications to handle the water vapor produced, ensuring the vehicle operates efficiently and safely. So, how do hydrogen internal combustion engines compare to traditional diesel engines? Both engines have a similar basic design and operational framework, which can make it easier for manufacturers to adapt existing diesel engine technologies for hydrogen use. Hydrogen engines aim to deliver similar torque and power outputs as diesel engines, making them suitable for heavy-duty applications. The primary difference lies in the fuel used. Hydrogen combustion produces only water vapor and minimal nitrogen oxides NOx, whereas diesel combustion releases carbon dioxide CO2, and other harmful pollutants. Hydrogen engines typically have lower thermal efficiency compared to hydrogen fuel cells. While fuel cells convert hydrogen directly into electricity, H2 ices convert chemical energy into mechanical energy, leading to some energy loss. Now, let's explore some manufacturers leading the way in hydrogen truck development. Nikola Corporation Nikola is at the forefront of hydrogen fuel cell technology with models like the Nikola 2 and Nikola Tray. These trucks utilize hydrogen fuel cells rather than an H2 ice, converting hydrogen into electricity to power electric motors. Nikola has ambitious plans to create a robust network of hydrogen refueling stations, addressing one of the biggest challenges in adopting hydrogen technology. Hyundai has launched the Exient Fuel Cell, a hydrogen fuel cell truck designed specifically for heavy-duty applications. It combines hydrogen storage with advanced fuel cell technology to achieve zero-emission performance. Hyundai emphasizes producing hydrogen from renewable sources, aligning with its commitment to sustainability and reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Volvo is actively exploring hydrogen fuel cell technology and is planning to integrate it into future electric truck offerings. Their strategy involves hybridizing fuel cell technology with battery electric systems, maximizing operational flexibility. By developing both hydrogen and electric options, Volvo aims to cater to a wider range of customer needs while promoting sustainability. Advantages of Hydrogen Semi-Trucks Hydrogen semi-trucks present several compelling advantages. Environmental benefits. 
Hydrogen trucks produce zero harmful emissions. This not only contributes to cleaner air, but also plays a significant role in addressing climate change. The potential for renewable hydrogen production aligns with global sustainability goals, helping to reduce the transportation sector's reliance on fossil fuels. Hydrogen fuel cells can offer longer ranges compared to battery electric trucks. For example, a hydrogen truck can typically travel 300 to 500 miles on a single tank, making it particularly suitable for long-haul routes. Refueling a hydrogen truck takes about 15 minutes, similar to traditional diesel refueling. This operational efficiency is crucial for logistics companies focusing on minimizing downtime. Payload Capacity Hydrogen fuel cells can be lighter than large battery systems, allowing for higher payload capacities. This is vital in the trucking industry, where maximizing cargo load translates directly into increased profitability. Despite their potential, hydrogen semi-trucks face significant challenges. Infrastructure The lack of hydrogen refueling stations remains a significant barrier to widespread adoption. Currently, there are far fewer hydrogen refueling stations compared to traditional fueling stations. Expanding hydrogen infrastructure requires substantial investment, coordination among public and private sectors, and government support to create a viable network. Production and cost The majority of hydrogen currently produced comes from natural gas reforming, which emits carbon dioxide during the process. This undermines the environmental benefits of using hydrogen as a fuel source. Green hydrogen produced through electrolysis using renewable energy sources is still relatively expensive and less widely available. Efforts to lower production costs are essential for widespread adoption. Energy efficiency. The process of producing, transporting, and using hydrogen can be less efficient than direct battery electric solutions. For example, energy losses occur during hydrogen production and transport, emphasizing the need for advancements in hydrogen production methods to enhance overall efficiency. Market competition Battery electric trucks are gaining significant traction in the market, with many manufacturers investing heavily in this technology. This creates competition for hydrogen-powered vehicles as the industry explores various sustainable solutions. So, what does the future hold for hydrogen semi-trucks? Various companies have initiated pilot programs to test hydrogen trucks in real-world scenarios. These trials are crucial for gathering data on performance, efficiency, and the practical challenges of using hydrogen as a fuel source. Companies are partnering with logistics firms to assess the feasibility of integrating hydrogen trucks into existing fleets. Some governments are offering incentives to encourage the development of hydrogen fuel cell technology and infrastructure as part of broader strategies to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Support can take the form of subsidies for hydrogen production, funding for infrastructure development, and regulations promoting zero-emission vehicles. Technological Achievements Ongoing research into hydrogen production, storage, and engine technology will play a critical role in overcoming current challenges. Innovations in electrolysis, for instance, could make green hydrogen more accessible and cost-effective. Improvements in fuel cell efficiency and durability are also essential for ensuring that hydrogen trucks can compete effectively with battery electric trucks. Collaboration across industries the future of hydrogen trucking will likely involve collaboration between automotive manufacturers, energy providers, and governments. Such partnerships can facilitate the establishment of hydrogen infrastructure and promote the growth of the hydrogen economy. In conclusion, hydrogen semi-trucks represent a promising solution for reducing emissions in the trucking industry. As technology improves and more renewable hydrogen becomes available, hydrogen trucks could play a vital role in creating a more sustainable freight transportation system. The ongoing research and pilot programs will be pivotal in determining the viability and market acceptance of hydrogen as a fuel for heavy-duty trucks. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching and remember to subscribe for much more trucking content.